know what I'm saying? Why are you looking at my butt? I'm gonna have to shit after this, Essie. I had to run up a check on him. A check on him. I wasn't born yesterday. On and flex on him. Pulled up before the check on him. That check on him. Had to buy the wreck on him. The wreck on him. I had to run up a check on him. A check on him. I had to run up a check on him. A check on him. I had to run up a check on him. A check on him. I had to run up a check on him. Nah, I'm looking. I feel ugly right now. Why? I don't know. I just do. You're not ugly. No, no but that's how I feel. I'd be feeling like that a lot of times too. But Girl. you're not ugly. I'm looking at you. You ain't ugly. You ain't twisted. What, what, what's good, man? Welcome back to the channel. I'm Ty, and we have uh, Mrs. Essie. <laughs> that was ass, Essie. Um. Anyways. I cooked dinner tonight. Uh, Renejo. Yeah, you did. You did. And we cooked breakfast today. And we ate some sausage, bacon, eggs, cheese, and pancakes. And I ate grits. Oh, yeah. And that's that. I don't eat grits. But for dinner... Sugar grits. That sounds disgusting. But for dinner, this is what, you know what I'm saying? Oh, I, I made... Grits. Look, you know what I'm saying? He I made, made the steak. He made the meal. Yeah, and so no, the, no, and the rice. And the rice. And I made the green beans and the mac and cheese. And this is just for Ryan Rose. But, um. This and I look rough because I just got done working out. No, you didn't. Why are you lying? I did. I did. I, I don't even want to talk too much. Uh, if something comes to my mind, we're going to talk about it. But right now, man, I'm just trying to dig in. You're going to have to talk about something. They want another talking subject. Oh, hmm. Talking subject. Uh, let's talk about let's talk about our parents. How we were raised. That's a good one. Yeah, let's do that. So, how were you raised, Ty? Um, I was raised. Damn, this shit good. Yeah. <laughs> Why do um, you laugh like that? That's a good. Me? Damn, this is hell. You did good. No. Me? I was born and raised in Warren, Ohio. A lot of people don't know where that is. It's in Trumbull County, Ohio, I believe. But I lived there for 11 years. Uh, <laughs> what? Oh, what you that? <laughs> I tried to put my foot up there to relax, but. <laughs> Um, I lived there for 11 years, and I, how, I was, <laughs> how I was raised, it was like, my, both my parents were strict as hell, you know what I'm saying? My, both my parents were strict as hell, um, it really got us, got me and my brother everything that, like, we didn't, I didn't have to sell drugs and stuff like that, hold on, god damn, bro, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? I didn't have to sell drugs and stuff, but they're gonna twist a lot of people. If you're from more, you know what goes on in that area. It's not the best area, man, but that's how I was raised, and I was raised to treat people with respect. Like, uh, to this day, if I talk to somebody of age, I still say yes, sir, no, ma'am, um, and just treat people with a lot of respect. My, my uh, my family is big on respect, man. Girl, you're making a mess. <laughs> my family is really big on respect and keeping the family close. Uh, all my family, we like this. You know what I'm saying? Me and my brother, man, close. Me and my dad, my mom, real close. Um, but one thing that happened, I don't agree with divorce. My parents got divorced when I was, I think, 12 or 13. And that hurt me a lot. So I told myself that I'm never going to. Um, if I get married, I'm not getting a divorce. That shit is dead. Because I don't want to put the kids through what I've been through. And, uh, yeah. How about you? <laughs> Essence. This macaroni oh. is good. And the green beans. I know. They're just good. Mm -hmm. Um, yeah, the same. I'm the oldest of, okay, yeah, I'm the oldest of oh, all I'm my sisters. I'm my pants, so I don't want to get no grease on them. Yeah, I'm the oldest 
um, out of all my siblings. Um, damn, my mama, um, sorry. Mm -hmm. My mom and my dad had me when they were in high school. They were like 17. Damn, for real? And so, uh, yeah, so I was raised by my mom a little bit. Mainly my grandma, huh? I just did a burn part. You know I, what I was raised? I'm sorry. Uh, no. What, cut what? me off. Well, I'm after all. I, I, I guess I don't have to say so. Listen, you know what? <laughs> you know what? Um, damn, what's my drink? <laughs> You need some of this? Yeah. Color boy. Oh my god. <laughs> Ew, what's wrong with you? That's how you make sure you taste the whole drink. Mm -mm. But growing up, my grandma said if you eat burnt stuff, um, they make you live longer. <laughs> That's ass, right? That's weird. I know everybody grandma got some weird shit that they be saying. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um but well, anyways. Yeah, forgot what I was saying. What was I saying? Some go. Um Oh yeah. So I was raised by my grandma. Cause my mom had me when she was in high school. She was basically a kid. And yeah. Um, my mom and dad were like homecoming queen and king. They were like the relationship goals in my high school. For real? Mm hmm And then they had me and... Was everybody excited? Oh, yeah, having a baby. Oh, shit. Uh, yeah, they, well, no. Uh, fuck. Let's see. There's a lot of people who did not like my mom in high school that wanted my, my dad. You know, you know them trifling hoes. Anyways. Like who? I can't talk too much. Oh, okay, my bad, Charlie. I know you're talking about. I know a couple trifling hoes. I can't say too much because... I can't... No, that's just so wrong. Anyways. Um, fuck it. Who gives a fuck, right? Basically, my little brother, who I love a lot, his, his mom was the side chick. Damn. <laughs> she was. And um, my dad had a hard up upbringing. Like, my dad is psycho. <laughs> my dad was in the army. My dad whooped my arm. Oh, I'm gonna tell you, I used to get my ass whooped every day. If there's seven days in a week, I'm not exaggerating, I will at least get whooped four and a half days out of seven. I was a bad kid. But it made me who I am into today, which is a nice, respectful young man. Very twisted. I grew up with my grandma for years till I was 17. And then, um, yeah, basically, she I lived in the same house for 17 years. Did you? I was born in Warren. And when my parents got divorced, I moved to Atlanta. Mm. And then from Atlanta, I basically stayed in the same house. Well, I lived in an apartment, and then I stayed in the house for like eight, nine years. Yeah, I stayed in the same house, same room for 17 years. With my grandma alone. Um, Do you have a mom, nickname for your grandma? Nana. And uh, my, uh, I would visit my mom every other weekend. And I would visit my dad once, like, like during the summer. Yeah. Yeah, my grandma's psychotic. <laughs> she is. Like she would ground me all the time. That would be a whooping too. Where you used to get ass whoopings? All the time. For what? You probably got whoopings for your attitude. Actually, be having an attitude sometimes. And people want to fuck with me. <laughs> you used to. You used to get whoopings for your attitude. Sometimes. I used to get I have anger issues, okay. Mm hmm That was bad. For real? Mm-hmm. What's it called? When I used to have an attitude, my dad used to pop me in the mouth. Or like this. Right in my mouth. Or this shit hurt the My brother, if you watch this, you know what I'm talking about. My dad used to do this. He either used to flick my mouth as hard as he can like this. Flick me in my mouth as hard as he can. 
Oh, it's just one thing called the Great Muda. <laughs> Dang, you took a big ass bite. He used to great, do this thing called the Great Muda, and he would go like this. And go like this to the back of your, like right here. As hard as he came up. And that shit would hurt. Essie, you want me to do the Great no. Muda to you? Hmm? Mm -mm. Yo, Essie is uh, weak. No, see, I was raised like old school, so I got them old school ass whoopings. My girl yeah, used to whip too. me Nigga, with, a freaking, the... with a stick one. Yeah, I got stick, iron and cord. I got, yeah, I got, got whooped with a damn. Cord. Yeah, listen. Listen, you... getting whooped like straight out the fucking shower. Tub? Oh yeah. Oh mm -hmm. my gosh. You ever get whooped with a damn metal uh uh hanger? Oh yeah, that. That shit hurt. Yeah. She would try to pin you down. Ooh, I used to, but no, my sister, I'm I'm crazy. Like, you know, my sister used to get whoopings. Mm -hmm. She would always call my name. I feel like I have to help. So I'll like be like fighting my mom and grandma to make them stop like whooping my You ain't get a whooping this bad. Listen, y'all, hold on. My sister would look like a monkey. Listen. <laughs> It, I gotta put my TV on the wall. I guess on the honor board. Right? <laughs> Essie, can you hold this right quick? All right, check this out. Back home, like we had at my uncle's house, we had this damn pole in the middle of the garage. My brother was having an attitude problem this one day, and my mom drove me and my brother all the way to my uncle's house. My brother put both hands on the pole, so he was like this. Well, his hands couldn't leave the pole. So my brother uh, got butt naked, and my mom whipped his ass, like, just like that, just on the pole. You know what I'm saying? Why are you looking at my butt? I was really looking at your elbows. <laughs> oh, is they, is they ashy? I was just trying to make sure they weren't, they're just dark. For real? Mm -hmm. Ashy just be pointing out people's insecurities. I'm insecure about my elbows. Yeah, you asked if I was looking at your ass, and I was trying to tell you what I was really looking at. No, my elbows are dark. Nothing wrong with that. But yeah, anyways, I grew up in a small country town, lived with my grandma for 17 years, visit my mom every other weekend. Uh, my family's not that close. Kind of sucks. I wish we were, but we're just not. Um, I'm gonna have to shit after this, Effie. All right, man, I hope you enjoyed that video. I'm about to finish eating.